Hey there everybody, it's Mark Crilly. I'm back with another video, and it's a special video indeed. We're doing the unboxing of Lost in Taiwan, my very latest graphic novel. Very excited to see this completed, published book, and to show you some of it uh, further on in this video. So let's go ahead and open this up. Oh my goodness, so many hours of work I put into this thing. And, oh, here it is. Flipped around, oh, lost in Taiwan. Feast your eyes, my friends. Oh, look at that. And I heard that when you take off this dust jacket, you get a completely different image on the uh, cover there, which I think is a very cool thing. They did this for My Last Summer with Cass. Look at that. Uh, and this, so this is only the second time I've been able to see something like that with one of my books. Cannot wait to get into this. Give me just a moment, I'll be back, and we're going to look at, uh, you know, some of the artwork and also give you a little sample reading of uh, one of the scenes in the story. All right, so as I said, I'm going to do a little reading of one of the scenes in the story, but before that, let's just splice in uh, a few of my favorite pieces of art uh, from the interior. Try not to spoil anything with this, but at least give you a little taste of what you're going to see when you read this story. Alright, so there's some of my favorite artwork from the story, and you can tell that I really wanted to make this immersive, you know, give you this feeling of being in Taiwan, uh, just like this main character, Paul. Now I'm going to get into reading a little sample passage now for you, just to set it up. His older brother, Theo, is the kind of expert uh, who has been living in Taiwan for a long time. Paul, very first time, knows almost nothing about Taiwan. And Theo and his girlfriend are about to leave on a sort of weekend vacation. So let's go ahead and jump into it. All right, man, we're out of here. Like I said, we'll be back tomorrow morning, 10 a.m., something like that. Uh-huh. This is my spare key to the apartment. Don't lose it. Yeah. You gonna be okay? I'm fine. Go. Have fun. Bye, Paul. See you tomorrow. Bye. Woman guide so look. How about? <sighs> Kyle, talk to me, bro. All right, it's Taiwan for sure, not Thailand. Dude says this thing's not like on every street corner or anything, but it can be found. The swoop. That's right, dude, the Nintendo swoop. You'd be like the only guy in America who has one. Well, the timing's not bad, actually. My brother just left town. I can do whatever I want now. What, he was stopping you going places? Not exactly. I'm just glad to be rid of him, you know? He was bugging the hell out of me. I hear you, man. Older brothers. Right? Okay, sorry, dude. I got a roll. But let me know if you score a swoop. Because that would be sick. I'm on it, my man. Adios! Yes! Okay, so, where is this place? Jesus. 
This town's like a freaking corn maze. Better get going. All right, so there's the end of my little dramatic reading. Gets you right to the precipice of when the real uh, adventure begins. You can see that I just had a, lo a lot of fun trying to capture the feeling of what it's like to be in Taiwan for the first time, uh, exploring all the incredible uh, details of the environment around you. And that is pretty much it for now, folks. I think I'll go ahead and wind this down. I really uh, want to thank you all in advance, any of you who choose to support me by uh, ordering this book or seeking it out at your local store. It really does mean a lot uh, to me. And if you do pick it up, let me know, especially by way of my social media. I'd love to hear what you think of it. Uh, I'm very excited for this book to get out into the world. But let's go ahead and wind this video down. I want to thank you all for your support. Uh, and I really hope you enjoyed this video. I'll be back with another one real soon.